Hey, what's up, everyone? It's TK here. TK with Dory Scar here. Do a quick video disclaimer: This is not footage from the Soldier Game console. All right. So I heard about this a couple of days ago. Then I seen the video again because someone I know on YouTube they report on it. I believe uh, iPod one reviewer go check her channel out. She does a lot of tech stuff, unboxings, all that good stuff. But I heard it from her a couple of days ago, and she did another video about it. So I decided. To look into this thing even more, checked out some unboxings, checked out someone do a tear down of the system, and all I have to say is, Soldier Boy, what the hell are you thinking? And to the people that's actually buying this thing, stupid, 369. Alright, so pretty much it's an emulator system. Yeah. Not only that, the UI is trash. Someone that actually did unbox them, he straight out broke it so once he opened it up, which is crazy. And it was nothing in there but like a little chip board and now it's pretty much it. It was just space, just air. <laughs> and I, I don't I don't know how the heck well I guess I guess he just going hire anyone, they'll just do it for him, be paying money for it, I guess, but Nintendo has been cracking down on emulator sites. This has been going on for a while. I'm not exactly sure when that has started, but I know that Nintendo has been cracking down on the they've been cracking down on the emulator sites for a while now. That's why they've been releasing like the emulator systems. You know, the NES from Nintendo. I'm pretty sure they then took down like all those type of games that was like up on emulator sites. And here goes Soldier Boy out here. Got a system. By the way, both of the systems he got handheld. And he actually has like a console. And he got another console one coming out. The console I saw looked like an Xbox One with an ugly ass PlayStation 3 controller. When you boot it up, you just got a blue screen. I mean, you got the icons. They got like Neo Geo, Game Boy, PS1, SD card. So you can play games off SD card and some other type of games. How many people are buying this junk? I don't know. But they are stupid. Apparently the handheld one was sold out. Like, really? You could get your ass an emulator on your cell phone and play that and be better off than getting the rip-off emulator system. I'm just freaking flabbergasted that people are actually buying this. And I'm just flabbergasted in general that he would try something like this. But hey... To those big Soldier Boy fans out there that's actually buying it, he finessing y'all ass. That's all I gotta say. But just wanna do a quick video. I'm just flabbergasted, like I said, that <laughs> this has actually happened. A lot of people on YouTube is actually trashing it, but I'm surprised to even see people who's actually buying the thing and doing a lot of it. He got another one coming out that looks like an Xbox One as well, but uh, it's a better design at least. But this is like an Xbox One controller, like it's pretty much like a whole Xbox ripoff design wise and apparently that one's supposed to be playing like Xbox games and PlayStation games like the new games I'm guessing but yeah Soldier Boy game okay okay Soldier Boy um yeah you could have just stuck with the Oya because the Oya did pretty much the exact same thing just didn't probably have like enough support for it, but no people did a little hacking thing and stuff with the Oya. Hey, you better off buying the Oya than getting the Soldier Boy game, just to be honest. But then you stop wasting your time. I'm not finna talk that long about this this tragic system. Uh I'll be I'll be on the lookout. I'll be trying to see if Soldier Boy getting sued for the rest of the money he even have. But uh I'll be on the lookout to see if he's getting sued anytime soon. I'm not gonna report on it, but I just gonna be on the lookout, keep my eyes peeled for that. But anyways, TK here, TK Dorscar, you leave your thoughts and comments down below. I'm not sure if I mentioned it as well in the video, but he also got like rip off Apple Watches, rip off beat by Dre's and some other stuff. He's selling it for the Lolo too. So he really out here finessing. I guess that the uh, Trish is uh despite put a in his pocket because uh, that junk got closed down so I guess he's trying to re-up right now.